people's lives. And we pray that we be able to take our positions and volunteer duties seriously and find ways which we We pray for those who fight to defend our country, that they will be protected and guided and no harm will come to them. We pray for those who are elected as leaders of our country, that whatever their persuasion, that they may be, that they will pay attention to that guidance and heed counsel and think of a, of a better way of the country. We, we bless those here at this meeting that we may be able to uh, use our time wisely and constructively in ways that will further the, uh, the common goals that we have. And we are grateful for these things, the bounteous blessings that we have. And these things we pray for the Son of Jesus Christ. Thank you. And our Pledge of Allegiance will be led by our hardworking man, Frank Bowman, Debbie Jogger. I just want to remind everybody that there is no pause after <laughs> One Nation. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Debbie. <laughs> Speak loudly through the microphone or come closer to the 
the telephone so the folks online can hear you. Hey, Mr. Chairman, I rise in the point of information. I suggest that everyone who plans to participate, as soon as they want the floor, walk to the front, the chair can recognize you, and then you can speak to the mic and be heard on the phone. <coughs> Thank you. Any further discussion on the amendment to strike the word photograph from the last paragraph? Seeing no further discussion, we will vote on just the amendment to strike the word photograph from the last paragraph in the uh, motion to adopt the special rules of order. All those in favor of striking the word photograph signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed by saying no? No. no. The ayes have it, the word photograph is stricken from the last paragraph of the special rules of order, which takes us back to the original motion. The original motion was to adopt the special rules of order, which are now amended. Is there any further discussion? Seeing no further discussion, the motion on the floor is whether or not we will accept the special rules of order as amended. All in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 All aye. opposed? Nay. The ayes have it. That video? Yes. Got to turn it off. Under Alaska Wire, it's half law. I'm allowed to. Oh, here. Daniel, we're not going to go through that again. Yes, we are apparently. So. If if I have to, I'll have the police eject you. This is a private meeting. Uh, this is a meeting I also attend and pay and also I, part of because I'm doesn't matter. Position. The body has directed you not to video. Turn it off. Call the police. Okay, you want to take an intermission just to break? It. Okay, we're going to take a break. I'm calling with the police. Please, Steve. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. First time. I can't. What's that? Bond, Christine. You have Frank here. Frank, will you? Hello, Mr. Yep. Okay, we're taking a recess here. We have a free break to uh, reprise uh, some issues. <laughs> Fortuitous, we sat next to each other. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All I gotta say is, we went through this 2012 December police decided not to get involved on that part. They wanted to shut down the meetings. So, what's, what's, the, what's your concern? I document the meetings so this way our district can have the most relevant and immediate information. But what about the, Is it still running? Yes. I mean, obviously, there'd be the danger of uh, getting into the hands of the same discussions and taking our seat. Gentlemen, I have been instructed by our parliamentarian and reminded that we need to take a vote on whether it is the end of the meeting. No, we're going to take a vote on this. Kevin, can you take a vote on this? I stood down in December 2012 on that stand. Excuse me. I would recommend that this body make an affirmation of the rule that we just passed and support of the chairman to have either the uh, camera taken down or the gentleman removed at this point. Well, so All right, do you understand it? Is that the word of discussion about it? Seconded. Uh, Second Mr. Rockers would like to speak quickly. Lance Roberts, just to remind, and I will speak against this Gestapo tactics. You know, we don't need to be the closed and non-transparent party. We have enough problems with the appearance of the integrity of our party in the state. It's the number one thing the Republican Party needs to fix, and it's not fixing it. And hiding things from the public and from our membership out there is not the way to go about it. Thank you. Could I speak to my motion, please? Uh, I think we'd be careful using that word. I would just like to remind the body that this is a society that has the ability to make rules and to implement them and to enforce them. And I would strongly suggest that we do that. This has nothing to do with civil law or public meetings. This is not any of those things. Any further discussion? Seeing none, all those. Uh, yes, 
Yes, did you have trouble hearing uh, the parliamentarian just now? I heard the car stand up, but Yeah. All right. Is there any further discussion on this affirmation to support the rule? All right. All those in favor of supporting the rules that you just passed to force Mr. Palmer to either turn off his recording equipment or to be removed from the room, signify by saying aye. Aye. All opposed? No. Nay. The ayes have it. So we'll continue. We'll go back to our break and we'll wait for the police. Mr. Palmer? Mr. Chairman, what would you do? Mr. Um, uh, brother, you're not here. You can't report back to the people. What's your preference? You had to appoint a temporary chair. If that's the I'll case, how is it that there is a so bonus vote from that district? Out. Where are we going to communicate? There is no bonus vote from that district. There is a temporary chair. Well, Daniel Palmer is here because he's a bonus vote for number eight. That's my point. I've been the bonus vote since 2000. Well, that's, that's true. And yesterday I declared that district unorganized and appointed Mr. Uh, Walter. Right. So Mr. Palmer is not currently. Appointed. So therefore, Mr. Palmer, you're not there. Are, are you saying that the state party has taken over another district? No, I'm saying that the district was not organized because it had neither chair nor vice chair. And it took a great effort to find someone who's willing to do the job. Right. And our rules say that the secretary Excuse me, in order for the people on the phone to understand what's going on, if you have something to say, you need to be recognized by the chair, come forward, stand close to this table, and speak loudly so that everybody on the phone can hear. Are we in recess? I just uh, want to point out that after are, are, are we in two recess? years of every single yes. meet, meeting, so. having a problem with the communications, having to talk about the mic, having to talk about get close to the phone, that maybe we should fix the communications for these meetings so we don't keep having the same exact problems every meeting with the microphones and the teleconference situation. And so the question I was asked that I was asked to repeat here was, has the state party taken over another district? You know, the rules say that if you don't have a chair in it, a vice chair um, to fulfill the roles that the secretary is supposed to call a convention. And so I guess we need to be informed if there's something going on. The SEC, the SEC is subordinate. They were handling it. They should be reporting. We're supposed to be getting minutes every month on SEC meetings, which we haven't been getting. And the SEC should be being informed if any thing of like order, that Mr. is being carried on. I thought we were in recess. We are in recess. We are. Hold on. Lance, do you know the rule you're talking about? Can you show it to me? I don't have a right to find it. Careful, you have a right Frank, could you just ask them to come if they come on to announce? Because we didn't have folks on there. I got it. Vinny has announced. Knew. So if people are on the phone, please come on. They need to announce it and let us know, please, or let you know who is it. Can you do that? Uh, the secretary has asked that anybody who has been recognized before log in for a second. So, what, what are your concerns in, in general? Not about what are your, what are your, what are your, what are your core driving issues? What are your concerns? Accountability. I mean, what, no, the Republican no. Party. What, what do you, what do you, what, what part of the Republican Party? Not, not too much clean up the Republican Party, but what's, what's your attachment to the Republican Party? Accountability. What's the party do that we want to be a part of? Not what do you want to change it, so what do you like about it? I'm just curious what you're, what's attracting you to it. Oh, it's supposed to be a uh, fiscal response. Yeah, so fiscal res res restraint. I'm just I'm trying to figure out what you're doing. it hasn't been that, so, but the thing is, it's accountability. Not just with the party itself, but the politics in general. So you look at the, as the party as being one to hold accountability, or your, your goal is to have accountability. I have accountability through the entire structure. It's accountability here, accountability at the office, and further. Okay, fair enough. Do you think that's the
Yeah. And the most best way to hold people accountable is the recording. Well, depends. Obviously, there's a different opinion here. I'm not going to make any snap judgments on what, you're, what you've seen and experienced. I know there's all kinds of things behind the scenes. But, uh, <laughs> so the fiscal the fiscal restraint is the main attraction of the public right of uh, life. Or, uh, what's the bill? Government or what are your other Well I have to say with the Republican Party Catching up on some stuff at home. Uh, Which reminds me, they never contacted me. They never received a phone call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three months. And they never contacted me about phone
Officer Wilson. Okay. They're asking that you leave the meeting. You're being trespassed. I uh, give me a sec here. I want to document this. We are handling refunds of money since she's not even considered part of the. Um, and from my understanding, they have marked my uh, district was organized. Yet I'm a voted in person, and it was never notified about the unorganization. In which case, my uh, supposedly my elected capacity was not. Anything to do with that. They're being told they have rules that there's no video team. That's, that's not the issue. The issue is. Anyway, no, it's a, it's a pair. That's number one. That's got to be the Number two, you're not a police vote right now. And because of that, if you don't see the issue, you will get me on um, I have a question. Why, was, why did you not call me? Why did you not call me and say, hey, the district. Because your district has never given the party a list of rules in it. Uh, sorry, you had that information last year. You, you guys can have this conversation at the time. The Millennium Hotel is actually trespassing. Okay, so the so so Millennium Hotel is trespassing. I want to make sure I'm not part Yes. Okay. And you look at me from the Okay. So, got that. I want to make sure I have that documented. Uh, I do suggest that you coordinate with him. I'm not asking you to leave the party. He's going to help set up a test convention. You can use all the help you can get. And if you're legitimately elected again, great. Man. Uh, just leave the camera behind. Uh, I'm sorry, but the camera's going to show up next time we get elected. And you can so, the camera. And then we'll go through this process over and over again Um, I want to take down my phone a little fast so this way you can get a hold of me. I'll get your phone. 907 So I have two cameras recording. So. Thank you, officers, for being very polite. You're welcome. Uh, oh, we got one got more it? Oh, 
Oh, you got, okay, the other officer, okay, I didn't know if he was actually coming or not, sorry. I know your hands are kind of full, but I really have a card with our... Oh, thank you very much. That's just our name for the incident number for today. All right. Got it? Should got it. <laughs> I want to burn you guys, so... Also put you at libel in case something does happen. Camera. Yes, it is. It's actually the Hero 2, uh, the Hero 3 is the newest model that they got right now. Have you ever used it underwater? Uh, yes, I have. Not so great video footage if it's really muddy or murky. Yeah. 